Pikachu, I choose you! Now, Pikachu, use Thunderbolt! Hello, inventing designers, engineers, and architects. In this tutorial, I will teach you how to export from SketchUp to Inventor, which in the example we will export with the Pikachu. Let's go to the tutorial. To start, we have to download an extension of SketchUp that is SketchUp STL inside the site extension warehouse. I am leaving the link here in the description of the video. Now let's install this extension, inside SketchUp. To do this open Google SketchUp, open a new file, then click on Window, then click on Preferences. Then just click on Extensions, Install Extensions, and look for the path you saved the downloaded extension, select it and click open, click yes, then ok twice. Ready, STL extension will be installed, to check that it was installed just click on file, then check that the export STL option already appears. Now let's go to the 3D warehouse site to download the Pikachu Pokemon. So you can export from SketchUp to Autodesk Inventor, then click on the link that I left in the description of the video, and access the site. After accessing it, simply type Pikachu and download the file, and then open it inside SketchUp. Now that we open the Pikachu, we will export it to STL file, clicking on file and then on export STL, then choose the unit as millimeters and click export, choose the location to save STL format and save. To import an STL file to the inventor there are two ways, one way is to use the FreeCAD software and another is without using FreeCAD. First I'll show using FreeCAD and during the video I'll show you how to do without using FreeCAD. I'll also show the advantages of using or not using, depending on your application, so be aware of the tutorial that instance will show the other method. To start the first method, click on the description of the video to access the FreeCAD website or wait for the end of the video that I will leave the link for you to download directly from my GrabCAD, along with the Pikachu in SketchUp and Inventor format. As soon as you open the site, choose the version of your Windows and how many bits it has to be able to download, as in my case it is 64 bits, this is what I download. After downloading, just install normally, there is no secret in the installation, just do as I do, and there is no serial or key of the product, as the name itself says, it's free. Now open the FreeCAD program, let's open the STL file of Pikachu, just find the file and open normally. You have to change the views of the program to transform the Pikachu STL file into step format, which is the format we need to open correction in Inventor, we need to click on the green icon with the file name, which in this case is the Pikachu, and then click the tab that is written start, then click part. Then click Part, then click Create Form from Mesh. 
When opening the tolerance screen just click on OK, do not need to change the value. See that while doing this I've already created several faces that are the meshes of Pikachu. Now right click on the green icon written Pikachu, and click delete. Now click the blue icon written Pikachu, then click file, then click export. Now save where you want Pikachu in step format, and can close FreeCAD without saving the file. Now we open the inventor, and we will open Pikachu in step format. We have the option to change the settings clicking on options, but I do not see need to do this. Then click open. To open it takes some time depending on the computer. Click finish without changing the surface settings, and our Pikachu is imported. Click composite, then click sculpt. Click OK, and so is our Pikachu carved. To paint our Pikachu click on Adjust, select the whole Pikachu, and choose the yellow with the RGB that we want. To find the RGB you can open the Pikachu of SketchUp. Give print screen on the screen, open the paint, and press Ctrl V, then just choose the color picker, and click the yellow Pikachu, then just click on edit colors, and thus discover the values of the RGB to put in the inventor. Let's now paint the eyes of the Pikachu, so just select the faces holding the control. To make the cheek red, see that we do not have suitable surfaces to paint, so we will have to use a tool called Freeform, in the Sphere option, so we can model the cheek of the Pikachu. Let's choose the radius of the sphere that fits the size of our Pikachu, and choose the plane where the sphere will be inserted. Now we have to model the sphere, making it in the abstract form we want. So just select the whole sphere, then click Edit Shape, so we can stretch and pull the faces of the sphere the way we want. See how easy it is to fit the sphere, the arrows serve to move on the Cartesian axis that we want, so we can place exactly at the point for the cheek.
it is also possible to click on the plane to drag. So we can drag on two axes at the same time after positioning click OK to save in position, then change the template. Note the way I model the sphere, click on the face we want to modify and drag with the help of the arrow. Now just paint the cheek and it's ready, and then repeat the process to the other cheek. And finally our Pikachu is ready, I'm going to change the styles of views to see how it looks, and then render, and I'll show you how to export without needing free cat, as I promised at the beginning of the video. We will now open Pikachu without using FreeCAD, so just change the type of the file that will open to STL, then find the STL file exported from SketchUp, and click Open. You can also before clicking Open click Options, and if you want to change the parameters, but do not think necessary. Now I will introduce you because this method is not advantageous. It is not advantageous, because when opening it is possible to paint the file in only one color, that is, you cannot put multiple colors, but if your file is only one color, this process is much faster, so here it is. Depending on your application. I would like to invite you to enter my GrabCAD, and download the Pikachu we made the export, so you can check out the drawing, and also along with Pikachu I will leave the FreeCAD software to be downloaded and also the Pikachu in SketchUp format. I also have another GrabCAD account that has other models, which are people exported from SketchUp to SolidWorks, if you are interested you can also download it. The two GrabCAD accounts left in the link of the tutorial description. I would also like to invite you to be part of my YouTube channel, clicking to sign up for the video if you are on the computer, or the link below if it is on your phone or tablet, this will help you receive new notifications of new tutorials that I will do, so that I may share my knowledge with you. I also invite you to click on enjoy in my video, so that you help me. So I will receive an incentive to make new videos with more quality to better serve you. Thank you very much and see you soon.